Stratus 2S includes a built-in Attitude Heading Reference System, or AHARS, for backup attitude and synthetic vision displays in ForeFlight Mobile. This system is self-contained and automatic, so pilot input is usually not required. However, there are some things to keep in mind for best performance. First, make sure you mount Stratus before you turn it on. As soon as Stratus is powered on, it begins to calibrate the AHARs. So if you turn on Stratus, then move it around the cockpit to mount it, the calibration may not be successful. Second, make sure the three lights on the front of Stratus face the tail of the aircraft. That is, Stratus should be parallel to the direction of flight. Also, be sure that Stratus is stable in flight and not sliding around. While it does not have to be level, it does need to be secured. The included suction cup mount is a great option for this. To bring up the attitude display in ForeFlight, tap the Attitude Indicator button at the top of the Maps page. This will open the split screen view with Attitude on the top and the moving map on the bottom, or left and right for landscape mode. If you subscribe to ForeFlight's Synthetic Vision package, you will see 3D terrain and obstacles as well. If the attitude does not look correct, it's easy to calibrate it. At the bottom left corner of the attitude display, tap the gear button to bring up the AHAR status page. Then tap the calibrate button at the top right. The fastest way to calibrate the attitude display is to tap the zero pitch and bank button in the middle of the screen. Then hit save. This is a great way to quickly adjust the attitude in cruise flight. If you'd like to make small changes, you can also manually adjust pitch or bank in one degree increments by tapping the arrows on the attitude display. Again, tap save when you're finished. This is handy for tailwheel airplanes on the ground where zero pitch and bank may not be appropriate. For more information, visit sporties.com stratus.